This is a, a drive-through tour with myself here in Stillwater Golf and Country Club. My name is Josh, if this is the first video you're finding me on. Um, but interestingly enough, Stillwater has two entrances. I'm going to give you a glimpse of their back entrance and then kind of talk about the pros of having two entrances to your community. So we, we drove through the front entrance and then we passed the clubhouse where the clubhouse will be and now we're coming to the rear entrance now i have the golf course on both right and left sides of me and we're coming here which will also be gated to veterans parkway now veterans parkway if you continue here this will take you to longleaf pine and if you turn left that's going to take you south to County Road 210. This is a four lane road that will just bring more convenience to your life. But this is the back entrance to Stillwater Golf and Country Club. It'll have a guard, it'll it'll have a gate, not a guard. Now, what's the benefit of this? The benefit is convenience and options. If you have all traffic falling in and out of one entrance, it could get congested. And if you live in the back of the community, it may take you five minutes just to get to the entrance. So um, two entrances to the community, without a doubt, is a positive. It will be less traffic in the community because whichever entrance you're closer to is the one that you will use. So in my opinion, um, this is fantastic and it's going to save you time to have quick access to Longleaf Pine and the front County Road 210. Can't wait to see this all come together. Right now it's March of 2023 and, and important for you to see that is the high school there and, and actually I'll do another I'll do another video down by the high school because if you're thinking about buying a home and it's going to be next to the high school that's going to create a lot of sound and noise that you need to be aware of so maybe you want to check out that video otherwise join our facebook group it's called moving to st john's county florida it's private and it's free the link is below there you'll see a lot of questions families like you are asking that's moving to the area you can also ask your questions too and see a ton of news and updates so you can be up to date on all the exciting things happening in st john's county i'll see you on the next video